So this old custom room is once again back with Android 14. We are talking about Bliss OS, Bliss custom room. It was already available with Android 7, 8, 9, 10 as far as I know all the previous versions 11, 12, 13. It's even updated to Android 14. Quite famous custom room. It's also available for PC by the way. You can install Bliss OS on your Windows PC as far as I know. I mean in your PC. Uh, but we are talking about the custom room right now. This is Bliss OS based on Android 14. So we have some of the things available which I just wanted to let you know. So make sure to watch this video till the end. First one is the launcher. This is also one of those custom rooms which brings you launcher, three base launcher, which is basically an alternative for you. I mean, we have a lot of custom rooms already available. So Bliss OS could be an alternate option in case you want to try out something different. It's literally same. But the thing is, in case you want to try something, a different custom room, which means different name, but things are basically same, then Bliss OS could be a choice for you. It depends upon you. I mean, if you want to use it or not, because I will tell you some of the things about this one very soon. As it is a launcher, three base launcher, which means all the same kind of options, features available here and there. Same is the recent panel. You have the clear all option, cut, kill, etc, etc. Same kind of options available. You can even take screenshots from that. Quick settings panel is in dark mode, which means black quick settings panel is here. So in case, even if you use light mode or dark mode, doesn't matter. The quick settings panel will stay in this mode. And this is the same which you have in Pixel devices by default or Pixel Experience custom room by default. Same kind of things are available here too. Including this, if I move on to the security and privacy options, you will find it brings you the facility for the latest Android 14 features like auto confirm, unlock, enhanced pin privacy. We also have the face fingerprint unlock. Both of these unlock options support. A lot of users use face unlock on the devices. A lot of users don't. So it depends upon you. I mean, if you use this thing, then it's available for you. If you don't, you can simply skip this thing very easily. Face unlock option is present here. Fingerprint option is already present here. Including this, one more thing, the feature which is available in Lineage OS, RAM is restrict USB. It's also present here. Could be a well good choice for you. This should be a very useful feature. It's available here in the more security and privacy options. You can choose the option second one, which I just I always use on my devices. It's a good option for you. In wallpapers and style, you will find the clocks, all the Android 14 clocks are available. While making this video, it's not based on the December security patch, which means the QPR new, new QPR1 clocks are not available. But other Android 14 features are present here, Android 14 lock screen clocks, same kind of options are also. One more thing is, in AppGrid, we have extra upgrades unlocked because this is not a Pixel launcher. So yes, you can explore them. Another thing is about the customization. As this is also one of the alternatives of all the custom rooms, we have many custom rooms available. Some custom rooms are quite similar to each other. This is also one of them. We have same kind of options and same kind of customizations available. You can see animations, buttons, gestures, etc. In miscellaneous, you will find one feature which is actually missing from here and that is the unlimited Google photo storage. It's not enabled in my case. Yes, I'm using unofficial version, but still it's, it's there. I mean, you don't have that feature available. If you need that, I think so. You have to apply some modules on a device. You can do that very easily by using some magic modules and all the same options like spoofing options, including Netflix spoof and the higher FPS in games. Those options are present here. You can even see the ignore window secure flags. If you move on to the theming option, you will find the custom fonts which you can apply, which I already applied right now. You have the option for icon packs, signal icons, and the other options like Wi-Fi icons, icon shape, etc. Same kind of options available here and there, which you can go and explore and enable them on a device if you want to in case. Other things are kind of same here. This is also one of those custom rooms which you can install or simply leave this. It's totally up to you. These are things I just want to let you know. One thing let me tell you that in the terms of smoothness, this custom room behaves so good. Maybe it is device specific, but the custom room is quite good and quite smooth. App opening, app closing speed is quite smooth, buttery smooth here. So this, this could be a very good option. This could be a very good reason in case if you want to try it out on a device. Could be a different thing, but yes, it's totally up to you. Link is available in the description. Make sure to like this video. I will see you in the next one. Until then, goodbye.